I mean, I don't think we're rescuing people. I mean, they are dead in the water, but... Oh, okay, we are evacuating from the seismic event. Huh? Oh, you can hear it. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh, uh oh oh. Come on. Hello, YouTube. Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Stormworks Build and Rescue. And yes, folks, we are back once again. And today we are back with our Creations episode. So today we have the Lynx Spectre. This is our first ship we're going to take out. Now, I've got several creations we're going to check out here today, uh, one including an aircraft. Uh, if anybody's asking, well, is this survival? No, this isn't exactly survival. We might crash the airplane just to test it and see what the damage does. Uh, maybe if it sinks. But, you do have to remember, ever since the update, the game is a lot more dynamic now. So, I can die, the NPCs can die, we can damage this boat, and it very may well go to the bottom of the ocean. So, I think we're actually going to start off by taking on a mission here. We'll check this boat out, take it out to sea, and uh, try to get some action here. But anyways, if you missed the last episode, I'll flash it in the top right corner. We did Shark Survival. It was absolutely amazing. Pretty funny. Uh, so if you want to check that out, and we will have Sinking Ship on Tuesday. So be sure to tune into that. But yeah, if you guys have any suggestions for Stormworks, comment below. And if you're enjoying Stormworks on the channel, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. It helps out my channel. And let's do this. Alright, we're all packed up, ready to go. See what kind of danger we can get into today. I think this boat's pretty much got it all. Uh, let me check one thing real quick. Let's go up to the front of the boat. Do... Yes, we do. Okay, I was looking for firefighting capabilities. Because we might run into that. So, I did add a couple things to the boat. I didn't actually check inside to see if these things existed. Uh, but I do have a firefighting uh, outfit. And I do have the uh, deep diving scuba gear. Just in case we need it. Oh, boy. Check out the cab in this thing. Oh, that is ridiculous looking. Alright, let's go ahead and start getting uh, some of the lights on here. Stern lights, there we go. Nav lights are on. We don't need a towing light right now. Let's go starboard lights. And we got emergency lights for rescue. Alright, so actually that beeping is, I believe, it's like a near collision button. Like we have this uh, little meter here going near collision on port side. Alright, so we need to get this thing out of here real quick. The water's actually kind of choppy right now. It's kind of surprising. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can get this thing cranked up. Ah, right, here we go. And turn those on there. Alright, she is... Is it actually cranked? Oh, there's a weather alert. Oh, we're getting a... Sounds like she's sputtering. Oh, and we don't actually... No, I don't think we're actually fully cranked. Might need to go down to the engine room here, and maybe there's another uh, crank here. I don't see any keys. Yeah, I'm assuming that's what it is. So let's go down to the engine room real quick. Alright, let's activate these. I hope we're not blowing this motor out. There we go. Pumps are on. Alright. Can we fire up? Here we go. Alright, engine fire. There we go. You know, I think that sputtering noise you're hearing is actually the stabilization trying to keep itself off the dock. Alright, here we are. Starting to roll out. Oh, I just scraped the side of that. That's fine. It's got bumpers, right? Uh, Looks like there's no damage there. Alright. Oh, oh, there it goes. That was the power I was looking for. Ah, yes. Time to get up on the open seas. So we have spotlights. We have a fire. We have towing capabilities here. Uh, there's a lifeboat. Uh, we've got a crane on the back. There's uh, four little bays back there. Plus we have these big towers on the back. Pretty good looking ship. Oh. Oh, you know what? That stabilization might be freaking it out on. Let's turn that off real quick. Maybe we don't need that quite yet. Alright, so I noticed some new missions here. We have seismic events. Is that the tsunami? Is that a fancy way of saying there's going to be a tsunami without there actually being one? Uh, deliver seismic sensor. Let's go ahead, since we have a crane... We'll do this like a two-parter. We'll deliver the sensor, and then we'll rescue the researchers from the seismic event. Which I'm not quite sure what that means. We'll have to see. Let's go ahead and do the, uh, the sensor real quick. So, let's go ahead and locate this on the map. Since, uh, hopefully we have the right craft for that. I think with the crane, we should be good to go. What are we looking for? Okay, oh my. Really? 12.4 kilometers that way. Might as well just punch it in the GPS, grab a coffee, and sit back and relax. 
All right, we got 914 by 2004. That should be our GPS coordinates. Go ahead and hit this. All right, setting course. Course laid in. Okay, are we good to go or? It says course is laid in. Actually, I guess we need to put cruise control on. Let's crank that up. There we go. Now, question is. Oh, there it goes. All right, starting to turn us. Oh, this thing is a. Seas are a little rough. I don't know. It seems like this uh, boat. Particularly after the update, it actually sets up pretty high. It's like the buoyancy has changed. All right, so while we're on our way out there, I better go ahead and learn about the uh, the crane. Looks like it's got four magnets. Hopefully, the seismic sensor will fit on this thing. I'm hoping it will. It can't be too huge. So we got that. There's your winch up and down. Okay. That's your mag all. Let's go ahead and turn the crane on real quick. Oh, that's the mag. I don't want to do that. Crane. There we go. There's your load zone. That's actually really cool looking. All right, so we got that. Oh man, this water, we're getting, we're actually kind of hitting it sideways there and this thing's just go listing back and forth, back and forth. It's doing a well of a job of keeping itself up though. Uh, pretty impressive so far. So there's our equipment there. Let's go ahead and get around. Ooh, we don't have any islands that we're coming towards. Do we? I hope not. All right, let's go ahead and get up to the front of the boat real quick. Oh, <laughs> might get a little seasick this episode. All right. Oh, we can turn on TV. Yep. Okay. Apparently nothing's on, huh? Let's go into the front here. There was a, there's a button out here. Okay, that's going to be probably the winch. Okay, yeah, it's your front winch. No, no islands. Okay, we're clear. Uh, looks like we got throttle lever. What is this to? Uh, I'm not really entirely sure, to be honest with you. Okay. All right. Is this the front? It seems like... Oh, it's the ladder. Okay, we might want to let that down just in case we fall out. There we go. All right, so I think we're pretty well set. We're still... Uh, how far are we out? We're 4.7 kilometers out. GPS is set for the general area. We'll get out and see what the uh, situation is. I'm really curious about the other seismic mission because I don't believe that was there. I think the sensor might have been, but... Yeah, I'm not really sure what's going to happen. All right, we are 1.2 kilometers out. Really hope this research drone is sitting on top of the water. I think it said we needed a boat and not a sub. All right, disengaging cruise control. All right, we're going to manually uh, get our way in there real quick. Actually, my crane's on the left side, so I need to get to the right side of the drone. All right, we're coming up on the site. It does look like it's on the surface there, I believe. Uh, yeah, there it is. Uh, we might need to turn. We have a side thruster, side to side movement thrusters. Okay, I think we need those. I should keep those cranked. All right, let's try not to hit their fancy equipment here. Okay, a little bit closer. That looks good, right? Right about there. Oh, that's got a long magnet on it. Okay. All right, well, let's make sure we can do this. Let's go and get some equipment on because we might be going in the water to, uh, might be going in there to actually activate it. So let's go diving equipment. All right. We got that on. We got our ladders down. Let's see. All right, drone. Uh, check for sharks. <laughs> Don't want to run into any of those. Okay, so. Oh, uh oh. We might crush this thing. This water's just moving us right now like crazy. There we go. Magnet is active. Uh, looks like we're going to have to back up here. I'm going to have to go to the front ladder, aren't I? believe so. All right, well, magnet's active. Let's see if we can get it with the crane. All right, so the crane is on. Let's go ahead and see if we can move this thing out. I don't know if we're quite far enough. Uh, yeah, I say we can grab it if it'll attach that magnet, which would be great if it would. Uh, let's do that. We need to go winch down. All right. Oh, I think I grabbed it. Uh, come on. There you go. Uh, we do have it attached. Let's go ahead and go winch up. Try to slide this thing aboard here. All right, it's looking, looking good. It's dragging it. You know, I didn't even need to activate the magnet on top of the drone. It's actually doing a good job right now. All right, here we go. Let's try not to bust their seismic sensor here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come on. Drag it up over that. <laughs> oh, boy. 
You know, don't we need one of these in the water constantly just in case of uh, underwater earthquakes and tsunamis? Is that a thing? That's fine. All right, so we got their equipment picked up. Let's go ahead and go boom. And let's turn the crane off. Will it return to its position? Yes, it will. All right, let's go. I think these might be the deck magnets. Let's see. Yeah, one of those connected. All right, she is aboard. Let's go ship her back off to the research base. All right, so we're on our way to take this drone back to its research base right there. Actually, yeah, we've been on this base before. Uh, I think we need to go around actually to the other side here. Let's turn cruise control off real quick. So I'm going to go around there. I'm going to drop off this drone, complete the mission, and we're going to check out the other mission that's, I'm assuming, related to this. Uh, something about rescuing people from a seismic event. Ah, such a beautiful day out on the open ocean. It would be terrible if something bad were to happen. Uh, let's go into missions. We're going to go to uh, the other seismic. Which I don't understand. Does the event happen here or what? Uh, let's get the call. Okay. A seismic research vessel has experienced engine failure during a survey. And they have requested help and are concerned about environmental conditions. Uh-oh, that's, uh, that's a thing. Okay, let's highlight this on the map. Let's see, what are we dealing with here? Where is their vessel? Okay, it should be highlighted. Uh, oh, it's only 2.4 kilometers out. We are actually pretty near the vessel right now. All right, let's go check and uh, help out our buddies here. They said they were suffering from engine failure, so I don't think we can do anything about that. That would be kind of cool to have some sort of tools. Uh, that way we can actually uh, maybe help try to repair a vessel. Or I guess we could tow them back if need be. All right, 2.4 kilometers out. All right, we're going to turn on our emergency lights here for rescue. Okay, what do those look like? Oh, it's kind of cool. You can see them flashing uh, blue and orange there. Or is it yellow? Uh, I think it's... Maybe it's yellow. All right, so 1.6 kilometers out. Let's go ahead. We're going to help our buddies out out here. I'm a little concerned when they say they're a little worried about the environment or... What were they doing out here? I mean, we obviously took uh, the last seismic sensor out. Uh, maybe they were putting a new one in or something. Wow, that's actually a pretty big vessel. Oh. Huh. Wow, I don't think I've ever seen that one in the game. That's pretty cool. All right, cruise control off. Let's go ahead. Let's ease up to our buddies here. So I don't see any smoke. So obviously uh, the engines just shut off, I think. Not unless we get closer and we see smoke. Uh, so we're not contending with fire. That's actually a nice looking ship. Wait, haven't we... Have we looked at that ship before? Hold on, we're going to pull alongside this thing. That kind of looks like a ship that we've checked out. Oh, maybe it isn't. All right. Uh... Let's pull alongside, investigate the vessel. Okay, well, I guess we'll just, we'll go here. A little concerned. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and get out. Uh, I guess we'll put it on our uh, gear here since we are going in the water. I would, I probably should just pull alongside him, but. Wait, the Pelican Vivid. Why do I feel like I noticed that ship? Haven't we checked that out before? Uh, I don't know. Oh, let's go ahead and get this on here. All right, diving suit is on. Let's go ahead, ladders are down. Let's go ahead and go get into the water here. Oop. All right, let's go see if we can help our buddies out here. I mean, I don't think we're rescuing people. I mean, they are dead in the water, but... Oh, okay, we are evacuating from the seismic event. Huh? It keeps using the word seismic event. Does it mean big wave? Hold on. Okay. I don't see anything. Huh? Look both ways. All right. All right, buddies. Let's go ahead and... Yeah, we've actually checked out this ship before. I'm almost 100% sure. Uh, maybe the Stormworks people just actually put it in a mission. That's pretty cool, though, to see. All right, looks like I got the captain in here. Let's go ahead. Nope. Okay, I thought the bridge was broken. All right, come on. Uh, as you can see, they do have health bars now, so they can drown. They can uh, fall, burn, and everything else. All right, buddy. Let's get out of here. All right, sir. Oh, no. Uh, sir, there seems to be a giant tsunami behind us. Okay, hunt. Come on. Come on, door. Come on. Okay, get in. Uh, we got to make sure we can try to save these people. All right, stay here. Uh, oh, boy. Wait, engineer. Engineer, is he below deck? 
Uh, we're gonna take the brunt of this one. Oh, these ships are gonna run into each other. Oh, ho, ho, ho. so there is missions with tsunamis, folks. Uh, okay, we got one, two. Is there a guy below deck? Okay. Yep, we're screwed. Okay, let's just go in. Uh, I guess we're gonna experience this from the inside. Come on. Okay. Everybody, go ahead and brace. Come on, door. Oh, boy. Move. I want to see it. I want to see the... Oh. Oh, no. This is gonna hurt. Should I sit down in the seat? Oh, there it is. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. We're gonna tip. We're gonna tip. Oh, hold on. Hold on to this side. I don't want to fall. Oh, you can hear it. Oh, Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, uh oh. Oh, come on. Right side up, right side up. Land. Oh, oh. Uh oh, that didn't sound good. What was that? Uh, okay, we're tipping. Uh, this is perfectly fine. Okay, so this is officially the most intense mission in Stormworks. We got issues. Okay, I'm pretty sure we have damage. All right, folks. Man, can we put scuba gear on the uh, NPCs? They probably don't have any in here, do they? Uh, what are we doing? Oh, jeez. Okay, we are below water. Okay, we need to go. Come on. I'm gonna get you to fall. I'm gonna go ahead and pick you up. Let's get you guys out in the water. Oh, boy. Uh, come on. Oh, vessel's going down. I need to get this guy up immediately, or he's gonna drown. Alright. Set up here. What does our ship look like? Are we good? Uh, okay, we appear to be... We're good. Oh, wow. I heard a big thump, so I know the two ships hit each other. And what feels really good about the mission is the whole fact that this actually matters now. Like, we have to save these people, or they will die. Ah, buddy. We got you. Let's go ahead. That should be the last person. Wait. I'm showing somebody. There's an engineer. Wait, how do we get up there? Uh, okay. Haunt. Get out over here. Let's get in the water. Hopefully a secondary tsunami doesn't come through. Alright. Oh, man. I hope we didn't punch a hole in our boat. Oh, boy. That could be terrible. Alright. Oh, do we have damage? Uh, where's this engineer? Oh, he's trapped. Oh, jeez. How do I get... I'm gonna have to go up in the boat and actually climb up, uh, somehow. I don't know how we're gonna do that. Uh, it's fine. We got oxygen. Love these new scuba diving suits. These are awesome. Is that... Okay, down is up. Alright, so let's try to get to our engineer here. Let's get our flashlight on real quick. Alright. Oh, jeez, come on. There we go. Uh, engine room. Okay, so he's in the engine room. Uh, you okay back here? Kind of took a bit of a ride, didn't we? Alright, let's see if I can get over to you real quick. Oh, there we go. Oh, boy. You injured? Oh, this person's injured. Uh, if we got a medical bed, we'll get him over to that. This is cool. Oh, boy. Okay, let's get out to the main corridor. Alright. Sarah, I'm going to have to ask you to hold your breath for just a second. Here we go. Uh, let's get him out here. Uh, actually, oh, now hold your breath. There we go. Oh, look, there's damage on top of the uh, on the deck here. That's where I think our ship hit it. All right, everybody. I'm going to go and get you guys to follow me and follow me. Let's go and get over to... Wait, where's our other boat? Oh, look at the damage it took on the front. Uh, okay, our boat's kind of drifting that way a little bit. We need to inspect our boat and make sure we don't have any leaks. Look at that. I think their boat's starting to go down a bit. Yep, I think it's definitely leaking. We need to go uh, down below deck and check ours. All right, buddy. It's the last person. Let's get them up on the deck. Uh, I don't know if I saw... I'm sure there is a medical bay here somewhere. So I need to get that one guy to actual bed. Should heal him up a bit. All right, everybody. Oh, no. We got damage. Look at that. Oh, that's not good. Okay. All right, everybody. You guys can set up here. I need to take this one back. You need to come with me. We're going to have to put you in a bed somewhere. Uh, Sarah, are you going to follow me? We got to get moving here. All right, everybody's aboard. We just need to evacuate them, so let's go ahead and get out of the area. Turn on cruise control. You can see we do have damage on the front of the ship, so hopefully... Uh, Hopefully that doesn't mean anything too bad. All right, we don't have any islands coming up. I hope they don't hit us with a secondary tsunami here. Uh, let's go up here. Normally, if it's an earthquake, there will be, like, multiple tsunamis. So we look clear right now. 
Alright, let's get below deck real quick. Let's go ahead and check the lower compartments, see if we have any leaks. Alright, here we are, lower compartments. It looks... Looks to be good. Engine room. Yep, I think we're okay. We just sustained a, a little bit of damage to the front end. Alright, well we gotta take these uh, people back to uh, the hospital, which is that way, but we did it. I mean, we actually did it. We survived the tsunami inside of a ship that was capsizing. I don't know how many times we overturned, but that was absolutely awesome. I hope to see some more missions like that soon. But anyways, let's go ahead and move on to the next thing. All right, since we were out a little bit longer than I thought we were going to be there on those missions, we're going to load in one more craft. This is the Ryanair 737-800 plus 2. I don't know what the plus 2 means, but this is a spectacular looking aircraft. And oh, oh, that's beautiful. Look at that. It's actually the paint job on that. That's a lot of detail for Stormworks. Hold on, let's hop up in this thing real quick. All right, there we go. Let's hop into here. Oh, cool. Oh, hey, look, a pooper. And you can flush it, okay? Let's see, we need to turn on some lights here. It's the cockpit. Wow. That's impressive looking, huh? And let's just close this and get going here. Okay, taxi lights, cockpit lights are on, beacon lights, landing lights, instrument lights, nav lights. Uh, oh, there's the cabin chime. There we go. Oh, there's emergency exits. All right. Flaps, gear switch, brakes. Okay, let's go ignition one. Actually, it's ignition two to one. There we go. All right. So, are we good to go? Or actually, the brakes are applied. Let's go and release the brakes. We uh, do appear to be rolling slowly. Uh, okay. So, this is a pretty decent sized runway. I do think we can get up off of this one. Ooh, we got our little stairs there. Oh, those are going to detach. Oh, they're actually, they got us stuck there. All right, there we go. Okay, let's go ahead, get ready to turn this. Oh, this is very maneuverable. All right, so let's go ahead. We need to edge out. Oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh, what just happened? Oh, I thought the gear went down in the front. Uh, you know, I really want a little more runway than this. We'll have to maybe back up or something. We need a pushback here. Okay, we're about in position here. All right, let's go ahead and apply the brakes. Here we go. Let's go up on the throttle. Let's make sure everything's good to go. Let me uh, figure out what the controls are. AD. Okay, so we would lift like that. All right, I got this. Let's go ahead, get ready to go here. Hopefully I can take off. All right. Let's do this. Oh boy. Oh, a little sideways. I saw a little puff of smoke. That's a little concerning. Maybe it's just the, uh, maybe it's just the tires. Okay, here we go. Uh, plane, I'm going to want you to lift a little bit, please. Should I put the gears or what about the flaps? Should I put the flaps back? Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh boy. Wait. What is. Okay, so if the flaps are back like that, wouldn't that. Wouldn't that be a bat? Yeah, that's, those are like brakes. I don't wonder if the update might have broken this one. The update uh, changed several things, especially uh, engine parts, and I don't wonder if that was a thing there. All right. Does it still work like a boat? Nope, it does not. All right, so I read through the instructions. I was not appearing to do anything wrong there, so I do believe it's an update thing, but we are going to... Just for science, we're going to test it one more time. Uh, because I don't want to sit there and be like, Oh, I just can't do it and give up after one try, because that's no fun. So, let's see if we can get one more bit of lift. You know, I could give myself some encouragement. We could spawn a tsunami in. Right, what's the, uh, what's the gear switch? Oh, that should be for the landing gear. I guess it pops open once we uh, climb to a certain altitude. Uh, that would make sense. Okay. So, there's no additional power here. There's nothing that I'm missing. It's just... I can't get it to take off at the moment. All right, so we got a little bit of extra runway this time. So, flaps. See, let's go ahead and even though that aerodynamically does not look right, it looks like air brakes. We're going to put those down. I don't think there's even an aerodynamic model in here, if I'm not mistaken. So, we'll put those down just to uh, test that. All right, we are good to go. Let's go ahead. Make sure on check the brakes. Okay, brakes are off. All right. Oh, we're rolling forward a bit. I can roll back just a bit more. And then we're going to jab the throttle and try to lift here. 
There we go. Come on, buddy. Oh, boy. It's a loud one, too. Uh-oh. Come on. I need you to lift for me. Oh, it is not lifting at all. Oh, we're going to use the ramp over here. We're going to get lift here, folks. This is going to happen. Uh-oh. Come on. Come on. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, 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 that smoke doesn't look good. Uh-oh, <laughs> what does that mean? Why are we smoking? Oh, we're burning out. Wow. All right. Oh, we damaged the motors. How great. Well, we'll come back to this one, folks. Well, this is going to be a rather awkward way to end this, but nonetheless, I had a lot of fun here today. Uh, we're going to use this tsunami one more time because why not? Uh, we're stuck on here. Maybe it'll assist us off. Now, we're not going to be doing tsunami survival every episode. It was just so happened that there was an actual mission uh, that had it, so we went ahead and used it again. But we will be returning to, like, normal sinking ship, normal missions. Uh, having a lot of fun with this update. It's absolutely amazing. And I think you guys have been enjoying it too. So I want to thank you guys for all the love and support here on the Stormworks series. You guys are absolutely amazing. Go check out these creations down in the description if you want to download those. And I do believe that this is going to hurt. Oh boy, that's not good. Say goodbye to the plane. Bye plane. Ooh. <laughs> oh, this thing still looks phenomenal. Oh, there goes the plane. Ooh.